really can't be holiday views. But back to work, I really need to get this last bit of this Google Data Analytics certification done. Let me not kid myself, I can't get nothing done out here. Let's go inside. All right, this should be easier to concentrate. So let's get to it. Just got to log into my Coursera account, finish a few activities, course challenges, a couple quizzes, and then finally I can continue with this holiday. Later that day. Congrats. Congratulations. Congratulations. Yes, I did it. I'm actually under this six month marker as well. What's that SpongeBob line again? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh yes, I am ready to get a data analyst job. Let me add this to my CV. Start applying for some jobs. Let the interviews come flooding in. And with the help of ChatGPT, I could probably get about 20 applications done before the night. I'm already thinking of getting promoted doing some sweet freelance work, even using YouTube as a platform to teach the world everything I know. The good life is here. Later. Let's see when they want to schedule me in for an interview. Wow. All I can see is rejections. I don't get it. Why well, can't get a simple interview? I listen to all the advice. I did all the courses. I even made a project portfolio. I feel like I just wasted six months of my time. Actually, one company hasn't gone back to me yet. Maybe there's still hope. A small chance. Hi Charles, your application was amazing, but unfortunately due to the current economic climate, we unfortunately have to put this position on hold. Best of luck to you in the future. Am I just hopeless? I don't know what to do. But don't despair, have hope. You see, I know many of you watching may feel like this, but to be honest with you, at some point or another this has been everybody's reality. Even mine. I mean, I made a whole video on it. So what do you do? Keep pushing. You see, at this point, you've probably learned the fundamentals of data analysis and even started creating your portfolio. But you need to go one step further. You need to be able to really separate yourself from the crowd, from the competition. And I have two recommendations on how you can do that. The first one being creating portfolio projects that are not only based on public data that you can get from places like Kaggle, but ones that are personalized to your life. So example being how many steps you walk a day, compared to how your weight has fluctuated over that same amount of time. This not only showcases to a hiring team or interviewer that you are able to go above and beyond, but also showcases that you can use data to make personalized change and you know problem solve for things that are personal and that actually matter to yourself. Second recommendation is to obtain certificates that actually showcase real skill, competence, and experience with data analyst tools, in particular here being BI tools. The two certificates that I wanna mention, one that I personally obtained being the Microsoft Certified Power BI Data Analyst Associate, and the second one being the Tableau Certified Data Analyst Certificate. Now what separates these two certificates in comparison to what maybe you're familiar with or ones that you've obtained yourself is that they're done in strict exam conditions. So a strict timer to complete the exam itself, and of course, an invigilator watching you while you're doing the test. So there's no chance for you to cheat to really actually test your foreign knowledge on the tools. Now, why this allows you to stand out is because they're harder to obtain based on what I've just given you. So because they're harder to obtain based on demand and supply, as there's not many people with a certificate in comparison to other ones, your value to companies goes up. So potentially, you look like a better candidate overall. Now, if you couple this with your personalized portfolio projects, and then of course, the ones based on public data sets, this gives you a more thorough, or let's just call it a holistic application going forward. Now, if you liked the video, then definitely leave me a like, comment about what you liked, 
have a look at these videos here because I'm sure they'll provide you with great value. And until next time, stay blessed, take care and peace.